Right now, students and teachers are making their way to Doherty High School for a vigil to remember a student killed earlier this week. 17-year-old Georgia Chicholia was walking to school when she was hit by a car that ran a red light. Radio News Channel 13's Andrea Herrera is live in Colorado Springs at the growing memorial after speaking with those close to her. Andrea. We know Georgia's parents flew in from Italy and are now here in Colorado Springs to be a part of the vigil tonight. The 17-year-old was part of an exchange program when she lost her life. She was really dedicated. Like she knew what she wanted and she was going for it. Elena Pacheco knew Georgia Trociola well. The two met back in August in Spanish class and became close. Elena says Georgia always had a smile on her face and was constantly thinking of new ways to better her life. She was really good at tennis and softball and swim. The last time I talked to her was about sports. Georgia aspired to be a professional softball or tennis player. She was very dedicated in school and was excited to go to college. Elena says there's not many students that had the ambition that Torciola had. She was really excited to go to college. And yeah, she would just talk to me about life and she was really proud. Elena says what happened is nothing short of tragedy, but she hopes change will come out of it. I don't think it should have taken her for them to notice something, you know, because there's multiple accidents that happened here. The candlelight visual will start at 530 this afternoon and it will be held at the softball field at the high school. There is currently a GoFundMe set up to help Georgia's parents who will be needing extra assistance for the funeral costs. If you wish to donate, we have that link on our KRDO.com page right now. Reporting live in Colorado Springs, Andrea Herrera, KRDO News Channel 13.